What's up guys and welcome back to another video. Today's video we're focusing on a new French team or not a new one but a team that's been taken over by its new investors that are set to swipe away millions, five million pounds of debt in order to regroup and restructure this team. Now they are currently situated in the Pro D2 um, league of French rugby and um, obviously that's underneath the top 14 where we know the likes of too long to lose etc etc all a part of but these guys are have big money billionaires and they're looking to transform this team into bringing them into the top 14 league where they can compete with other top other top teams over in france but there's talk of them linking up with maybe bowden barrett well starved dan bigger Ma Nanu's even involved in the discussions all in bringing this tough this team to the club bay Beezers or Beezers, um, which could uh, create a few interesting terms right now. I mean, Bowden Barrett, we all know he's, he's strongly with the Blues and doing well for his team. Marnon is overseas um, in America playing his rugby. So now the fact that these guys could head over, just imagine what they're going to be paid in order to take these deals. Now, obviously, with New Zealand and the rules, I don't know if Barrett's going to take it straight away because of if in order to play for New Zealand you've got to play rugby in New Zealand so maybe he could go on a sabbatical or he will just not play for a few months and go overseas and play for this team and see what happens and how it comes up amongst but um, there's a lot of players that they're looking at um, and it's going to be interesting they said this investors are set to swipe away the club's five million pound worth of deaths and heavily and invest heavily in star power to push the team into top 14. Barrett and Beggar are set to be on the high on their wish list according to reports so it's going to be interesting to see how and if they get to uh, go on about this one because i mean jeep is barrett's huge biggest huge marnano all black veteran and legend i mean to get these names is going to be absolutely massive and it, 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 you can actually see it. I mean, the power of big names like that coming into a smaller team can really shock the world and take a team. It's almost like David Beckham when he joined LA Galaxy and the transformation that happened there. But yeah, it says former French international Christopher Dimitri is, is said to be representing the new investors and they are already active on the market according to the French media outlet. So it's going to be interesting. Some stats for those who don't know this team is Bezers, for, correct me if I'm wrong or how to pronounce this, have won 11 French championship titles since its established in, in 1911, but have fallen down the tables in recent years, even facing um, the times of red relegation in the Federal One at the end of the 2008-9 season. They stand ninth in the Pro D Tour and face complete overall if they want to win relegation um, form for the super competitive second division, which is currently includes the likes of Grenoble, Baritza, and, and a few other teams. So it's going to be interesting to see what happens and how they go about this and how the market of big players like your Marnanus, your Bodie Barretts, your, your damn biggers, and how they can totally transform the, the, the a team. And it just shows when you get investors in the right place to transform teams, it can definitely help and benefit but um, it makes you wonder how much these boys are going to be paid in order to leave their current situation and go play in, a, in like a lower league in order to build a team up. We've seen it happen before and we've seen teams get really transformed into great strides. But it'll be interesting to see if these guys take the deal. They're the top of his wish list or the billionaire's wish list. So we'll see whether or not they actually go forward for me. Hey, it's great when you can see someone transform a weaker team that was once... A, pretty good and bring them back to the level um, of intensity um, but obviously they will need to progress in order to produce the goods um, so it's going to be interesting we'll see what happens i personally don't think Bowden barrett's going to accept it just yet maybe in the future maybe um, after a few more years playing for the all blacks but um, at this stage with the ruling of new zealand rugby i don't see it happening bigger definitely there's been a lot of talk of him moving out and um, obviously more known as playing overseas better deal than in france why not take it so we'll have to wait and see what's going to happen let me know your thoughts in the comment section down below on this topic very interesting but the uae billionaires are targeting some big names who are they going to get 
we'll have to wait and see that's going to do it for today's video guys i hope you enjoyed it give it a thumbs up subscribe if you're new and i'll see you real soon for another one stay safe and never give up cheers